Three months ago, we got back one of our oldest Clash bases. I thought it was never gonna see it again. It was a miracle. But today, guys, I just got one question. Where is that base? Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to the show with Speakers Lab. The gang is back, you guys know what it is. Look, I'm your host, Speaker. I hope you guys are doing good. We got Melly and Pi over there as well. Hey, so as we said in the intro, do you guys remember, a lot of you probably remember, a lot of you probably saw this video. It was, it was a really fun video. I think it was about three months ago, we found one of our oldest bases and we got it back. Like I thought it had been lost forever. I thought I was never gonna see it again because I just never connected it to a Supercell ID. So to make a long story short, like we don't need to go through that whole thing because a lot of you guys probably already saw the video, but all we did was contact Supercell support. I didn't even tell him I was a YouTuber. Like I felt like I would sound like kind of a tool if I did that, which I would have. So I didn't mention that and we got it back. Amazing. But a lot of you guys, especially recently have said, what's going on over there? Like, are we doing a series? Like, what are we doing? Did we somehow lose the base again? I mean, that's actually me wondering that. <laughs> guys, what if we go over there and you know how the village girl will like attack you? She thinks you're a goblin and she attacks you. I actually want that to happen now. Okay, okay, I'm ready to go. Wow, Paya, that is a good look. <laughs> Okay, so you may think it's a little strange for me to worry about like losing one of my bases or not having one of my bases. I get nervous about this dude for one specific reason. There was one time where we logged into one of our bases and I'm not even gonna go into detail. I'm just gonna say there was an issue. Okay, so it's Beaker 08 down at the bottom, Town Hall 5, which by the way, has gotta go to Town Hall 6. We gotta do this soon. Here we go. All right, guys, so we got some good news and some bad news. The base is safe. Nice. I mean, I can't argue with that. I would care. If something happened to this base again, I, I would care. Secondly, though, and kind of the bad news, look at that. I'm pretty sure that if we had waited just a little bit longer, we would have had the village girl come back out and, and fight us. Although I could be wrong. I might have accidentally logged in. I know that sounds absurd, but sometimes I do just spam the buttons and I accidentally log into the wrong base. Mission failure. All right, now, as we talked about last time, my favorite part about this is right here. 1,815 days. This is so sick. Like, this just, it doesn't really show anything except how inactive this clan has been and how inactive this base has been because it's been here the whole time. I don't even know when it joined. Doesn't matter. How many days are in five years? The answer is 1,826.21 days. Okay, team, fun fact number one, we can upgrade the sound all today. In fact, I think we will. Now, we'll get to that in a second. All we got to do is, is upgrade, uh, not even upgrade, build one cannon, one arch tower, and 25 walls. But the other thing I want to do before we do any of that, look at the spell factory. We've never had spells in this base. We've never dropped a single spell. These spells right here, uh, right there, they're already trained. Those will be the first spells we've ever dropped. That sounds kind of cool to me. Like, I, I kind of want to do this. Okay, now we've cooked up the dumbest army. Like, I don't think this is gonna work. Nobody in my attack log, well, some of these people are kind of using this. Basically, we just got a ton of barbarians. What do we got? What? Yes! Hey, so should we get some of these flags and stuff? It's such a waste of money at the beginning, but I do love having them. Well, here we go. Let's try. I'm sorry. Try again. Oh my God. This is not gonna be good. This is not going to be good. Let's go. Man, I have not done that in so long. It is kind of satisfying, although this base is definitely not gonna work for that. Well, maybe, I don't know. We've already almost got the town hall swarming around the base. I should have dropped them faster, but it was almost more fun just dropping them one at a time, just in a big circle. Okay, showdown, what's going on? All the all the best defenses are in the middle, like one mortar, one whiz tower, it's just gonna wreck us. But let's see what happens. How many barbs are even in here? Not enough, dude. It doesn't matter. Watch this. Yeah. 
Sorry, gang. Okay, well, that was interesting. Guys, this is such a mess over here. Like, doing raids over here, you really gotta be in the mood for it, right? I wish we had more troops, which, if we wanna do that, we gotta go to the next town hall. You guys ready to do this? Hey, there's one other question that I wanna ask you guys. So, I don't really wanna get anything on this base except for, you know, maybe some booster potions. Like, I, I wanna be able to boost the, uh, barracks. That's really fun. When you're doing it in a video, you can do like three raids, boom, boom, boom. Anyway, guys, you know what? The more I think about it, I may love runes. I may love uh, wall rings. But the thing I want to support most in any game I'm playing is the cosmetic stuff, the, the skins, the customization stuff, because it doesn't affect the game in any way. It just allows you to be your own weirdo. This is going to be so absurd. Oh, no. What have I done? There's no going back from this, is there? Unless I... Unless I called my credit card company right now and was like, well, it's Apple. Unless I called Apple right now and was like, yeah, my bunny just bought that. I don't know. I don't know how that happened. We're not going to do that. Let's see what it looks like. Well, anyway, guys, you know what that means. We've now got to get all the stuff that we need to do to make sure that we can upgrade to the next town hall. It's very few things. It's right here. We got to get uh, what's in the resources. What is that? I don't understand. You're telling me the builder is a resource building? Okay, but there's 27 defenses over here, and most of those are walls, but let's go over here and get the cannon. Oh, that looks great. Two. One. Peace! That's my dude. You know, it's not even that much different. I think it's just, I'm so used to this color green. Anytime they change the background, the grass color, it weirds me out. Anyway, moving on. I gotta not get hung up on weird stuff. I'm weird, so it happens. Dude, that looks so great right there. Between the gem box and the giant stone, I love this. All right, man, here we go. One final thing, the walls. I'm sure we had some level one walls before. I kind of love these. I've told you guys, they're kind of like decorations to me, just these wooden spikes. I wish they let you get these wooden spikes. I mean, it could be a good decoration. Anyway, what? how did I mess this up? This is a very simple task. How did I mess this up? Okay. That's it? That's the whole thing. I guess that's 25 walls. Yeah, okay, makes sense. You guys, the only thing left to do here, if we wanna get better troops, if we wanna get more troops, the only thing left to do is upgrade that town hall. Let's do it up, man. The defenses are what they are, but the offense is gonna be so fun. We're gonna get healers. We're gonna get more levels of troops. This is it, dude. In three, two, one. Mission complete. I sort of feel different right now than I did at the beginning of this video. And I gotta tell you guys something. Um, I didn't want to bring it up earlier because it really did, I mean, it didn't like bum me out. It just was like shocking. I had kind of forgotten that. Uh, today is Lulu's birthday. And um, I just want to say we miss you, buddy. We love you. And uh, Melly and Pyre, we love you guys too. Lulu, if you guys don't know, was my first pet ever, right? Um, many, many years ago, I, I adopted her and just sort of, was this fluke thing. I never was like, oh, I'm going to be a bunny guy. <laughs> and like, you know, it may seem weird to the average person who comes along to this channel. They're like, why does this person have bunnies? And I understand that. Many years ago, I got this bunny named Lulu. It was one of the best things because it just made me into a better person. You know, having a pet, everybody knows, uh, most of you guys know if you've had a pet, it really can make you into a better person. You, you know, you, you're more empathetic, you're more caring. It's sort of the first thing in your life maybe that you really have to take care of besides yourself, which meant a lot to me. It still does. So I wasn't exactly ready to talk about that today, but uh, happy birthday, Lulu. We miss you, buddy. Um, and we'll, we'll celebrate that soon, I think. As always, leave two for Lulu, three for Melly, four for Paya. Two for Lulu forever, though. I don't know what we're going to be doing tomorrow, but it's never mattered to me before, really, right? <laughs> Sometimes we make plans, but, uh, you know, I told you guys about this. I have ADHD and it's... Like, I'm not joking about it. Like, I get treated for it and everything I always have. And uh, I don't really like making plans. Can't really do it anyway. So uh, let's just get on here tomorrow, press record, and whatever happens, happens. I think you guys have enough channels in your life that are like super the opposite of that, which is great. We just need to be chaos to balance things out. All right, we love you guys. We'll see you right here tomorrow on the one and only Beaker's Lab. Peace. Hey, you, monster, what are you doing? Why are you on my desk? I mean, it's fine, but... Okay, see ya.